We're gonna try to survive again in 60 seconds. Get all the stuff that we need, throw it in our place, and then we're gonna send our kids out to die so the parents can live and then make more kids later. Hi guys, I'm Cinnamon Toast. 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 Now we're back in the morning, 60 seconds. God dang it, I just wanna beat this game so bad. I can play on easy. You know, just just to beat it, just to see what the ending looks like. But no, that's the easy way out. We're normal. All right, there's the sun, and ooh, there's a lot of stuff right here in the hallway. All right, sun. Where's the wife, and then the daughters over there somewhere probably. Okay, sun, prepare to get my pocket, cause I'm going to take you to a new world and some water to the shelter. Da, 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 da. There's an axe in the wall. You know, speaking of that, might as well just grab it, cause it's right there, and the axe. And I can't pick up anything else right at the moment, so throw that in there. Bloop. I mean, I could pick up more stuff, but you know, you know what I'm saying. Poison, why not? It's right there. Urgh, to the shelter. Da, 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 da. Da, 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 da. Waifu! We got a bunch of water in the in here for no reason. We'll take it. To the shelter! Da, 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 da. I need a radio. There's all that stuff in the hallway here. Grab it, grab it, grab it, grab it, grab it. Hoot. Uh, can I grab one more thing before time runs out? Oh no! That was gonna be so great! Dang it! Ah! Oh. Alright, I think we can make one more quick, 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 quick run. And what is that? Grab it! Grab it! No! Boom! Made it! Oh! Oh, so close. <laughs> uh, did we give you giddy? I don't think I got much food and water, though. Maybe I did. Day one. Uh, yeah, we did, pretty, we did pretty decently. We got a lot of stuff in here. Uh, we had a board game in here anyway. I made the shelter for the blast. Nice. Plenty of water and best stock shelter wherever, wherever did see. Sweet. Always want to throw a party, a huge cake. Uh, yeah, radioactive clouds will be gone. But we have the gas mask, right? So we can send someone out and they'll be okay. Is that, is that correct? Am I correct in thinking that? You know, we're sending, we're sending, we're going to send Mary Jane out tomorrow. We're going to put the gas mask on and test this. Uh, distant relatives, none of them. Oh, we can't really do anything with that. So tough boobs. All right. We're thirsty today, they said. But, you know, we're sending her out, so screw her. And she's going. She'll take the gas mask. Good luck out there, young lady. Don't die. You know, I'd actually be pretty amazed if the gas mask protects her from radioactive poisoning. I don't think you breathe that in. I think you just get it through, like, being around radioactivity. Uh, Timmy is very brave. Everyone looks good. All right. Well, all right. We felt like some in the corner of the shelter is a rat. Shoot that rat. Just don't shoot somebody else, though. Day five. Whatever it was is dead now. Quite dead. Good news. There's nothing new. Life is hard. Ted's fine. Sweet. Everyone's good. All right. Day eight. She's back, and she looks not good. <laughs> she doesn't look very good at all. I knew it. The government's not falling. Yay. She came back with... Oh, she brought back the gas mask. She didn't get poisoning, either. And she, uh, it doesn't seem promising. The mine ventures the ruins of the local bank, hoping to find something. It looks like the bank was robbed just for the blast. The vault was, uh, cracked. Teddy bears, who does that? Anyway, we see why they wanted to rob it so bad. This place is filled with tomato soup cans. All right, did we get some? We got four. Oh, snap, we found a shopping bag next to the counters. Rot bananas, hand cream, pair of bunny slippers, some bottled water. Sweet. Oh, that is a nice. Oh, and a lock. Holy crap. Mary Jane is starving. We better get her some food. All right, Mary Jane, you earned it. You earned a can of tomato soup. You know what? Timmy's going out next. That was amazing. Uh, uh, problem is simple. It, feels, it smells really bad. Well, we got the gas mask for that. Timmy, you're going out, so we're not giving you squat. Take the gas mask because it's still radioactive out there. Good luck, sir. Open in the name of freedom. Sure, okay, we'll open it. Uh, don't rob us, please. Day 12. Uh, do we lose anything? It looks like it's all still here. Oh, they gave us an axe! The Wolverines! Thank you! Day 13! Timmy's back! Timmy, what'd you get us? What'd you, what'd you, what'd you, what'd you get us? That's new, okay, so, uh... Alright, we got our gas mask back again. We found the Boy Scouts, neighbor picked up boots, we found the tunnel, we found a flashlight, and he's very hungry and tired. Uh, should I send out the, uh, an adult? You know, why not? Let's see what the radio says. Let's see if the government's out there somewhere. 
Oh, the kids are fine again. I should have sent one of them out. I think I will, actually. Ha <laughs> ha! Mary Jane's quite hungry, but she's rested. Oh, you're not getting any food because you're going out. You're going out with the gas mask again. <laughs> uh, get out of here! Get out of here! Day 15, yeah! Put my kids to work. Ah, oh, crap, we're getting flooded. Uh, what do we save? I guess we gotta save the goddamn radio and lose our playing cards and our map, which our map will be very useful to figure out where we're supposed to go, but God, for a lip and dang it. Okay, the ventilation system. Let's take a look with the flashlight. <sighs> then the bugs are gonna attack us. 17! Oh, yep, we got injured, of course. God dang bugs and ventilation. I think an event block check was blocking it. However, when you shine your flashlight on the hive of mutant insects, Angry hive insects for they fled. Might look like that, but he's a strong young boy. He's doing just fine. Life is hard for us right now. All right, and Ted was hurt. All right, oh, she's back. Oh, she broke the. Oh, well, I don't think I need it anymore anyway. She went to the theater. She got some soup and some water. Oh, my hero and our playing cards back. But we still need a map. All right, let's get ready for another excursion or whatever. Crazy crawling insects. They're spiders. Use the Boy Scout book on them. Use the Boy Scout book. Day 19. Ooh, we got some water. The book were precious. They are a precious weapon for waging total war on insects. Uh, fear will keep the local spiders in line. Fear is the Scout handbook. While crashing down the shelter, we found a misplaced water bottle. And I guess I'm sending the waifu out because the kids are not fit for going out. Take the lock with you, I guess. Whatever that does. I don't really know what the lock does. I should probably learn what these things do. Let's get ahead to fix it. Uh, yeah, let's fix our our mask. This seems like the best thing we got so far. Did we, we fixed it! Hooray! Oh, gosh, she still looks so bad. I, th I think I'm supposed to, with the Boy Scout book, I'm supposed to be able to, to ration out supplies over an extra day. But like I said, I don't really know what a lot of this stuff does. We need to open the door. Okay, open the door. Fine, before someone goes crazy. All right, Mary Jane's worried. Uh, apple juice right now. I should give him some water. Timmy needs water. Ted needs food. The wife hasn't come back yet. It's not very good, is it? Alert! There's a gang of firefighters outside. They're dressed like ones. They're banging the door. Use the gun! Use the gun to oppose them. Day 24. Gunshots. Oh, she's back. And yeah, we all look like crap. Oh, my gun broke too. Dang it. All right. Uh, we lost the gun. A few shots enough to send those cowards running. The question is what happened to the rifle malfunctions when you were all out of ammo. Oh, man. All right, we're surprised that the metro station wasn't abandoned. Nice! We got some water? Woo! Some water from the toilets! Ah, oh, nice. Didn't expect a phone call so soon. Ted, you're the only one that can go. Go answer the phone. Day 25. Ted is sick. Ted's gonna die. Ted is not gonna make it. Ted is happy to risk his life. Well, Ted, you may have to because I don't think you're gonna freaking make it. Hitch of the shelter's been rising. Panic attack. Open the door. Dolores has been mad about this. She's not giving up. Should we... All right, yeah, I guess. Fine. Day 27. Oh, Timmy's okay now. Good. Good, good, good. Because he's going to go out. Uh, Mary Jane is rested. Timmy is rested. Uh, and Ted needs some water. All right, Ted, don't freaking die. All right, we got two people that can go out now. Sweet. Uh, the army broadcast. We need a map. We don't have a map, so we can't tell where they want us to go. God dang it. Day 28. All right. Everybody seems fine. Timmy needs water, but he's going out, so screw you, Timmy. Timmy, take the gas mask, I guess. The gas mask seems like the best thing ever so far. I doubt he's coming back, but maybe. Maybe he will. There's a plant seed. Should we plant it? We need a bottle of water. Okay, maybe... Maybe it's worth. Maybe it's worth. Maybe we'll die from it. I don't know. Here goes nothing. Soul seeds water. We'll see what happens in a few days' time. The Raider camp on the street's been maddening lately. They're st we stand for it. Someone should show them what's what. Take the axe after them. Go get that axe on them, boys. All right, we're still alive. Good. Good. What happened with that? We lost our axe. Dang it. We won the battle. These bands were no match for us. We quickly overpowered them and forced them ever out of the camp. Quite exhausted. Uh, trash cans getting disgusting. Good news, we don't have much of an appetite. So we don't save us some food. For some reason, they'd like to tie this mess. Those giant green cockroaches are a pretty good motivator. Wait, 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 wait. Giant green cockroaches. So I guess we should use bug spray? I guess the cockroaches? Okay, we lost her. That was close. And that's those glowing bugs might have been worse. The drive is the wasteland. Roaches are the worst, but radioactive roaches? Yikes! A bunch of people dressed in with Halloween outfits. 
Uh, they're asking if we have any spare hydrogen peroxide. Uh, we don't have much water left. Uh, here, okay, have some water and give us some medicine, please. And then I hope Timmy comes back. Oh, Timmy, is that you? Oh, you didn't bring any water, Timmy. Oh, Timmy didn't bring any water. Uh, we gave them a bottle of water, wish for the journey, better luck with the trousers. So afraid Timmy came back, the wasteland is safe with us now. And what did he get for us? Some soup. A young woman dressed in white knocked at her door telling us a story. Her missing twin brother is probably held captive to bandit cap. He tried to feed a big bandit leader. His sister feared something might have happened to him. She claims to know that we're good, trustworthy people and believes that we can help. If we do, she must say a solid... Okay. Send our daughter out. Go handle it, young lady. The woman quickly called a group of friends and set for what turned out to be a successful mission. Finding the twin brother wasn't a problem. He was hanging at the top of some antenna next to the fence, trying to escape. Nothing made us happier than the sight of Mary Jane returning to the shelter from the surface. Mary Jane seems fine. Timmy should eat something. Dolores is doing quite well. Ted doesn't drink. He won't last long. All right. Uh, whatever. We can't do anything about whatever that is, so we may lose the rest of our water and be screwed. 37. Oh, he died! No! No! Ted's wounds are too serious! Oh, we couldn't fight the plant! We grew the plant and attacks and took our food! Oh, no! Tim is very hungry. Well, Mary Jane, you're going out. Good luck. Take the flashlight, I guess? See you later. Come back with water, please. Oh, Timmy left! Timmy's gone! Oh, lack of water drove Timmy insane! Uh, 100% behind that idea. We can't do anything about them right now. Today was calm for Dolores. Good. Uh, working radio. Maybe you catch a broadcast or two. Sure. Oh, she's going crazy. God dang it. Has she gone crazy? Something blew up inside the radio. No! Her sanity's questionable. We don't have any water to give her! Oh no! It looks like it's the end of the road! Day 42. Ah, oh, dang it. Come on. Something magical happened. I can't give her any water. I can give her some food. You know, maybe that'll... The bandit camp. I can't do anything about the bandit camp. Everything's broken. Oh, it's the end. The end. I knew it. She's dead. Oh, man. We made it so far. We're trying our best to remain calm. The situation far from normal might use it. We hope help comes soon. Mary Jane was supposed to be back. It's been too long. She's dead. And we survived for 44 days. Dang it. Maybe if we had a map, we could have done something. Ah! Crap! All right, you know what? Just to give it a try, I'm going to put it on Little Boy. Because I want to see what the god dang ending of this game looks like. Ah! All right, let's grab some stuff. Grab the gas mask. Grab that. Grab that. Okay. We've got a lot of our random things we need. Grab the Daltair. Come here, girl. Grab the board game, I guess, for kicks. So we don't get bored and stuff. All right, let's go over here and grab the wife. Grab the radio. Grab the water. I see the Boy Scout handbook right there, too. Get out of my way, TV. I got to get through. Okay, and the sun is in here. Grab that. Grab some soups. Okay, get back to the shelter. Get out of the way, get out of the way, get out of the way. All right, sure, grab a gun. What, or, well, no, we won't grab the gun. Grab soup, soup, soup. Water to the shelter. Okay, grab the gun off the wall, please. Just grab it. And then go in here and grab that and that. Oh, God dang it. Uh, we don't have enough time to get anything else. All right. Day one. We are freaking stocked up. Of course, it's also um, easy right now, but that's okay because I need some. Oh, look. So we got a flashlight, a briefcase, and some soup in here. Just because, oh, and a lot, oh my god. Oh, there's stuff in the suitcase, got you. Man, we got a lot of stuff. Well, we don't have as much water as I'd like, but you know, whatever. Oh, the galloping horse is here. Let him look at our map. Of course, always let the galloping horse look at your map. I guess, I don't know if they ever do anything. Like, mess your map up or not, but they always seem to just give us stuff. Yeah, they gave us an ax. We have almost everything. You guys can have some water. We're sending uh, Timmy out. Take a gas mask, son. Oh. All right, people dressed in Halloween doctor outfits. Sure, take some water and give us something in return, please. Be nice. They, they were grateful anyway. We didn't have what they wanted. Well, what a bunch of jerks. 
Uh, down here, Mary Jane. It's her birthday. Have some cards. Yay. Playing cards. You know, I always wonder where these guys go to the bathroom at down here. Is there a toilet? Uh oh. Day nine. Hey, Timmy's back. What'd you get, buddy? What'd you get us? You brought the gas mask back now? All right. Where'd you go? Uh, Robo Town turned a few. Oh, we got some soup in the banded truck. Nice. Water bottle scanner at the cashier's booth. Mary Jane's thirsty. And Timmy needs to eat. Everyone needs water except for Timmy. All right. All right. All right, we're sending out the next kid. <laughs> uh, quick sh knock on her door. We opened and found a suitcase. Sure, why not? Let's open it up and see if it explodes in her face and kills somebody. Day 10. Nobody's hurt, but Timmy doesn't look very good. He looks sick and tired. All right, what was in the suitcase? Innocent looking bottle of water. We took a sip, thought it lucky. It was a lie. Oh man, made us feel pretty sick. Dang. Ooh, we peeked out for just a minute. We heard some growling and some eyes. Put the flashlight on it, see what it is. Maybe it's just a, a happy dog. Ooh, roof, I heard it. Never shows the dog, I guess. Side check out, guess what, there's a dog. Oh, yay. Timmy's in terrible shape, we need to give him water now. Oh, she's back, good, day 17. What? Oh, she brought water, hot. You are the hero. You are the hero right now. All right, she ran to a group of freaky dressed like wizards. They were eager to trade supplies, a few items. Sent a fair deal, so we invited them in. They're really a sad guy purchasing a pair of old socks, which have been lying in the corner for some time now, living their own life. The wi wizards got them in exchange for a few bottles of water. One of them plays the socks near his ears and started to dance. Uh, there's a ring. Wife, go out there and answer it. Okay, it's the normal phone call we always get. They'll get back to us. She came back. Miller tries to again. They said the first steps. Ring survivors. Plane will sweep over a neighbor. Ooh, signal with the flashlight. We have a flashlight. Hot dog. Uh, everything's planned, but the flashlight stopped working. Lucky fix it time to hear the distance roar of the plane engines. We're pretty sure the pilot saw us. Let's hope they get back to us. Whew. You're going out, and you are going to take the gas mask, I guess. I don't think it's radiated anymore, but, you know, it's cool, right? It's cool. All right, waifu's gone. So, kids, how are you? Dad jokes. Barking at our doorstep can mean one thing. The dog's back. Nat Karen has his wasteland rush open. There he was. The poor thing seemed tired and starving. Yeah, give him some food. We got like a whole box of soup over here, so that's cool. Have some, have some food, doggy. Yay, doggy, day 21. All right, I kind of skipped out on some people, so they should be in pretty rough shape. The dog was former self of under an hour. We don't know what put that soup, but man, this stuff is good. Saw the dog's name. His name is Pancake. Come here, Pancake. Who's a good boy? Pancake stayed for a while, but was gone next morning. We can bet he'll be back. Green pajamas, knocking your hat. Something about something that we anticipated. Yeah, this is exactly what happened for them. Since they were merry men. They wish to take from the rich and give to the poor. Uh, no. Because we are rich in comparison to other people right now. We do not wish to talk to you, merry men. Uh, we answered those particular calls, kept the door locked, noise fade away. We're not exactly sure what those people will come back. They sound harmless enough, but harmless people trust in the trouble times. Might be worse. Yeah. Uh, mary Jane's injured her last condition. She didn't mention it to us. We didn't notice it. It wasn't a problem just now. It seems her injury got infected and is in bad shape. We must help her. I mean... <laughs> The only option we have is an axe, so we must help her. Okay, Mary Jane, day 24. Oh my God, Timmy's gone. All right, she's very sick. There's nothing we could have done to make it better. He understood and decides better off far away from such irresponsible parents. He left and never came back. Mary Jane got the wrong idea when we brandished the axe. She tried to limp out of the bunker. Fortunately, she was too slow. We were able to explain our intentions before she ran off. Heating the axe blade allowed us to clean the wound and stop from festering. Oh, thank God. Now it's up to our immune system to fight off the infection. We had to break the axe to do so, but she's looking better. Day, we hope it's worth it. Oh, man. Pretty strangers probably are, uh, they, God, they captured Dolores. We don't think they let her go. Great. Oh, man, great. They took the wife. Ted is pretty fatigued. Well, I guess we'll go send Ted out. Uh, Pancake came back, very agitated about something. He really wanted us to get out and follow him somewhere in the neighborhood. This seems a bit risky. Maybe Pancake's on the trail or something. What gear should we take? Uh, the map, so we can make it back, I guess. Oh, man! Oh, snap! Well, we're going to take some map. That's what we always say. Thanks for the, the trusty atlas. We're going to take a look at the devastation of our town and get rather sheltered. It's uh, time for dinner. Pancake tagged along for a while. He left before we got to the bunker. Before we got back, we are able to take a detour and get some cans locked in the car. Good thing we didn't... There's some reading about car mechanics in the Scout Handbook. Nice. Mary Jane's been asking about water all day. Okay, here you go. You're probably gonna die from another radio broadcast elementary. A huge shock for us. 
Uh, they also order survivors to get rid of their firearms. Are they nuts? How are we supposed to defend ourselves? It better be worth it. Uh, I mean, no. I will not get rid of my freaking firearm. So I didn't know the stupid orders. Are they trying to, they would, government that probably doesn't mean to take a gun over our dead bodies. Mary Jane's pretty fatigued. Mary Jane, don't die, okay? Heard quiet knock on our door. Found a suitcase. Sure, we'll check inside the goddamn suitcase. Ah, oh, Ted, you made it back. Good for you, Ted. What'd you find? All right, Ted found a can and lost the lock. All right, there's a group of elderly people nearby. Yes, we're gonna rob the elderly. Rob the elderly! Day 32. There's blood handprints. Well, we lost something actually, didn't we? Uh, I thought we got some soup, never mind. Oh yeah. We didn't think anything could be worse than nuclear bomb dropping on our heads. We were wrong. We buried Pancake next to the shelter. Oh, Pancake! A nice place right under what used to be our white fence. We had we had thought about eating him, but there are some lines you do not cross. Even the most dire circumstances do not your friend, even if they're pancakes. <laughs> yeah, sorry, Pancake. Trash is getting disgusting. We got bug spray. Spray them bugs. All right, there's something making noise. We better check out the flashlight. See what it is. Oh God, that didn't sound good. Oh man, she does not look good. At oh, I'm injured too. Great. Oh, uh, barely made a love. Giant mutated crocodile and alligator. Oh, Mary Jane caught something nasty, and Ted was hurt. Oh, uh, we were afraid the army wouldn't get back to us. Eventually, the next transmission is full of evacuation promises. But if the big if the speaker requests that each survivor group armed with firearms dispose them before they get rescued. We don't know what this is about, but it sounds like violating our rights. On the other hand, the laws and rights left for themselves. Okay, we'll get rid of the gun. Fine, we'll get rid of it. Military orders get rid of the rifle. What if the heavy heart price getting safe paved gladly here? Yeah. Great. I used the freaking radio and it broke. Fantastic. Cockroaches use the Boy Scout handbook against them. Oh, Jesus Christ. We dodged a bullet this time. Bullet, huge Harry had eight legs and glowing head. And we're hungry. Ted might have some nasty scars if those wounds ever heal. Well, they probably won't. Because I can't get any mess. And there's a man at our doorstep. He wants to be our friend. At least that's what he says. Looks harmless. Although I have an argue extra pair of arms as a result of some weird mutation. He assures he will not get sick if he asks for help. Uh, we will not get sick. Uh, provide him with the, some supplies. Well, we have plenty of food. So here you go. Have some soup, buddy. Have some soup. We can really use some more supplies. All right. Good luck, guys. Go get the supplies. And she's gone. Mary Jane Tinders enough to make her angry at us. She decided we didn't do anything about them. We got found a note. Uh, she deserves better. And she left for Canada because it had a better public health care system. Uh, we went and got a radio. All right. Sweet. And Ted needs some water, but he got sick. Ah, oh, Ted. Jesus Christ, man. Come on, man. Come on. Hang in there, Ted. You're the last one. You're the last Mohican. Day 48. Don't die, buddy. Oh, he's crazy. Great. Great. Someone asked if we could spare any food, water. We can spare food. I got so much food, god dang it, and everyone is gone around me. Day 50. Oh, he's not crazy anymore. That's good. So we gave him some food. All right, there's a guy with a whole bunch of mutated arms asking for food. I'm just giving food out. I got food. I'm like freaking the Walmart of the post-apocalyptic world. And I need you guys to give me something, please. Please, someone just hand me a med kit. For the love of God, anybody, anybody. Oh, day 54, Ted, hang in there, buddy. Our airflow is stopped. Let's use the Boy Scout handbook. Because every time I use a flashlight, it's bad. Day 56, what happened? Someone drew some stuff that I can't go check it because I only got Ted left and Ted is in no shape to go outside. The end. Fudge! Ted! Why? We're not going to run around like knights around table following some madman scribbles on the wall. Eventually, Ted become more and more absent-minded. So this morning, he being completely committed in reading the newspaper, rather something that he seemed like it's a newspaper or a toilet tissue. Very seemed very interested in it. And then uh, he ripped the map to pieces. Ted's wounds are too serious, and he died. Ugh. We made it to day 50, god dang eight. We still can't beat the game. Oh my god. Ah! And we have perished. Thank you very much, guys, for watching. <laughs>
I tried to be. I tried so hard, but I just can't do it. The game's too hard. Thank you very much for watching, guys. I'm going to have to look up on a wiki or something to figure out how to beat this thing, and the next time we'll beat it. See you guys next time for sure, and until then, stay toasty, my friends.